All right, so if we thought that the other arm bar was crazy from the Kindle reusing one where we, the devastation arm bar, this one is the death pistol. This one is extremely dangerous, so just be careful. But at the same time, it's really fun to practice. So you gotta find that like balance between like extremely dangerous and a lot of fun and pleasure tapping people out with this mission. <laughs> All right, so our partner lays down side mount again. I think this is the last side mount one we're showing today. Okay, and basically what I'm gonna do is push his arm so I can get this hand, the cross face hand into his armpit. That is the most crucial part of this. I'm here, I push and I just tuck my hand in just like that, okay? My knee that's by his hip right now is gonna come to alignment with the armpit. So my knee was here, it's gonna come into alignment with the armpit, okay? And you'll probably see that a little bit better with other angles. Knee here, like this. All right. <clears throat> push, grab, my knee comes in, and now it's in alignment with the armpit. I'm gonna sit back, and I kind of sit back on my right hip, or my right butt cheek, however you wanna kinda of look at that. Sit back like this. Look how I brought him on me, okay? Let's do that again. Boom, flopping over, and now look how I immediately started catching my partner, and this is how I got him into the crucifix position from side mount, okay? switch over and now I'm gonna lock him into this triangle position, okay? And now he's still caught into the pistol gripped arm bar and now Ten. I'm gonna finish the pistol grip arm bar. He can't really tap, so he's just gonna like scream it. Tap. <laughs> just like that. All right, so I'm in this position and I am attacking the arm. I'm not even squeezing the triangle. I'm not even attempting to choke him. I could put a lot, I could squeeze his head, but I feel like it's gonna hurt his neck too. So I'm just gonna give it all tap. to the arm, okay? You tap with your foot too. It hurts your neck to say it. <laughs> Face this way. So I'm here. I got the cross face. Remember, this hand, cross face hand, wants to dive into the armpit and make a cupping uh, hand. So boom, armpit in, pull him back. I've locked. Now I push over the head. Now I'm here. He's tapping with his foot. Okay. So this is where the arm bar, this is the action right here. There, like that. Okay. You could, again, I could finish this triangle really tight, squeeze, it's gonna get tight on him, okay? But again, just please be careful with your partners. I'd hate to be the reason why someone got hurt in a gym. But I'm able to do this to people and not, you know, hit them with a death pistol. It's a rubber bullet. It hurts, you know, they stop rioting, but it's non-lethal, you know? Here, boom. Okay, this foot, if you get it like that, that's the easiest foot to probably grab. But now I need a transitionary foot to come over and hold that for me because this foot's gonna come out in triangle. Lock, and now he's in the triangle. That's already tapping him. And that arm bar taps him quick, okay? Whatever, whatever angle. You're my angle guy, bro. And charging angles. Okay. Right. See, look at my foot. Look at my footwork. I kind of roll the dough here. He's flat. I kind of push him over, and my knee's in position. This foot's ready to get the grab. It's ready to grab that arm as soon as I fall. See, over here. He's in a shitty position. You can probably just tap someone just by flexing backwards and pushing their arms and shoulders like this. Look, I can make this to tap, right? He's a strong guy. It just doesn't feel good. Okay, now I'm gonna come over and lock this up. And now he's tapping and then with the arm. So again, like I said, death arm bar, death pistol right here, guys. Um, be really careful. Um, if I could just show getting into that crucifix position one more time, Troy, it's just really slow. I just feel like, turn it kind of onto your side. Turn, turn it on your side. My knee's coming like this, okay? And then when he falls back, he comes onto my leg like this. And that's what's allowing our legs to be free over here to capture the arm, okay? So kind of watch the, that happen and play out. I'm here, I push. I turn in. So look at how my foot actually windshield wipers too. I didn't even realize I was really doing that. So I come in, windshield wiper kind of thing. And then I pull him back. Look how much he's on my thigh and how free this leg is. I could put this over his head if I wanted to. I mean, I'm not that flexible of a crazy guy. So it's just in. So there's no flexibility excuses here. It's just the angle that we're creating. Over, over his head, and then down. Okay, I can lock this up. It just gets worse on his neck. But that is the uh, crucifixed 
pistol grip armbar, but we're calling it the death pistol over here. 